things are going to work out for your good. You might not can't see it, but it's working out. It's working out even though you can't see it. I know in my heart that, Lord, you are my God. You are my Redeemer. My Redeemer lives, and he lives inside of me. I have a question for you. How far will you go to God? How far will you go? Turn to the person next to you and say, how far will you go for God? Answer them. Okay, I hear somebody say, all the way. What else you said? What else they said? What you say? I'm sorry, what did you say, sir? As long as you live. He said, as long as you live. Now, that was a question that was thrown at you. Okay, when your bills are not paid, when you have a bill, how far are you going to go for him? Are you going to go and try to work overtime when there is no overtime? Or are you going to trust in the Lord and lean not on your own understanding, but acknowledge him in all your ways? And he said he will direct your path. So how far will you go for him? All right. You said all the way. And somebody else said what? The rest of my said the rest of their life. Okay, now I'm going to show you what happens when you go all the way. Here are some apostles that went all the way and died on the battlefield. Peter crucified head downward. You'll go all the way. Matthew called Levi after preaching. The king sent forth men to run him through with a sword, a spear. John died in the bed, uh, died in the bed at an old age, having worn out his body. But you say you'll go all the way. Jesus, I mean, James, killed by a sword of Herod. Andrew crucified on the cross, not like Christ. A cord was used to hold him up, up to the cross, which caused him to linger and suffer. But I'll go all the way, Lord, all the way. I'm going all the way. Think about it. Thomas, by means of a dart, James stoned to death. Simon was crucified, not like Christ. Philip stoned also, uh, stoned, also was like Peter, crucified head downward. Judas, 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 Judas died by his own hand. Bartholomew was beaten down, then crucified, and then beheaded. How much will you take for the Lord? These are all the examples. How much would you go through for Christ Jesus? Would you be willing to tell the devil no, no matter what he brings to you to tempt you? Will you still tell him no, whether it be money? Will you tell him no? The Lord wants you to think about what you're saying. When you can go into the hospital and there's nobody there, to pray for you, 
Nobody there. They may pray on the outside, but you don't know nothing about it. There's no one there but you and God. Will you still go all the way with the pains going through your body? Will you still all go all the way for him? The Lord wants us to worship him. He wants us to bring worship in our lives. 